Well, people across the country will be spending their day giving back in honor of Martin Luther King Jr. Day, and that includes some right here in our area. Around 50 volunteers from Mommy Valley Habitat for Humanity will help out at the Eleanor Kale Senior Center. Those volunteers will not only install cabinets at the center, but they'll also work on a lending library outside. And this month, Martin Luther King Jr. would have been 94. Yeah, today one local nonprofit in his name is celebrating his life by helping our community. Christy Gerlitt joins us live to explain. Christy, you're talking about the Martin Luther King Kitchen who's been serving the needy for nearly 55 years. Yes, they have. Good morning, Tim and Kaylee. The nonprofit is, of course, named after the late Dr. King and has been run by another junior's family, Harvey Savage Jr. For years, the Martin Luther King Kitchen for the Poor opened in 1969, one year after Dr. King's murder. The kitchen serves the community year round, but today is extra special. WTOL spoke to one volunteer who will be helping pass out today's grab and go lunches. She has been giving her time to the nonprofit for a while. I have a sense of pride because I have known about the kitchen and to be able to come back here and help just makes me feel proud. Now the kitchen will be holding a service this morning at 10 a.m. It will be held at the Los Salem Church, which is located right next to the kitchen. Today's lunch is free and open to the public. Now after the service, there will be a march in honor of Dr. King. After the march, the kitchen will pass out the lunches. Coming up in the next half hour, you will hear from Mr. Savage Jr. about the impact this local kitchen has on the community. Reporting live in studio, Christy Gerlet, WTOL 11.